Hi, I'm Karima. I'm a digital advertising specialist and a data analyst. I'm excited to introduce you to this data analytics course. So as you know, in today's world, data is the new currency. Companies across industries like e-commerce, advertising, marketing, healthcare, finance, or you name it, all rely on data to improve their sales, profits, make new processes, spot trends, and make informed decisions. There's a whole lot of data everywhere around us, and every data has a story. The value of data lies in the story it tells, and it needs an eye who look into it and make a factual story that can help people around. And this is how I explain the job of a data analyst. So a data analyst uses data to transform it into valuable insights, which can help the world handle problems. So before going further, I would like to set expectations for this course. First of all, the question comes into your mind, like who is this course for? Are there any prerequisites that you need to have before getting into this course? So I would like to tell you that this course is for you. If you're here, if you're listening to this thing, like if you're curious to know what is data analysis, so this course is definitely for you. Whether you're starting a career or a professional, or you're already a professional who's looking for an upgrade in career, or if you're just exploring data's potential, this course is for you. Uh, this course will open doors to exciting opportunities in analytics. Currently, there are nearly thousands of open analytics jobs offering above average entry level salary, and they are growing annually at 20%. So you can see that there is kind of a big scope if you're, if you're getting stuck with data analysis. Companies are seeking skilled data analysts to solve challenges and drive business decisions. And completing this course will equip you to confidently provide strategic data-driven insights to any organization. So throughout this, throughout this program, you will tackle various assignments and projects that mirror the real world task of a data analyst. So basically it's, it's not only about being a data analyst and there are like different contexts of being an analyst in different environments. So if you are working in a market, if you're interested to work in a marketing field, you will be a marketing analyst. If you are working in a financial field where you're seeing that how much profit your company is going to make or how much sales are going to rise or fall in the coming upcoming time, you're going to be a financial analyst. So this term analyst depends on in which industry you work. So basically, uh, I would like to give you the overview of this course, like what are we going to cover in this course? So throughout this program, we will tackle various assignments and projects that will mirror the real world task of a data analyst. You will learn to formulate precise questions and grasp project objectives through this course. Moreover, you will master the art of cleaning and organizing extensive data sets for robust analysis. You'll gain proficiency in utilizing diverse tools and techniques to identify patterns and unveil correlations between different data points. Additionally, you'll also acquire skills in designing impactful visuals and dashboards to effectively communicate your findings, which is kind of very important to show that how your data, how your results look like. Finally, uh, through this course, you will have a chance to create a compelling case study that will showcase your expertise to employers on your resume. So if you're going to give your interview for a data analyst, this case study will definitely help your employer understand what level of data analysis you know about. So in this uh, curriculum, you will work with a range of essential tools and platforms. So like you will be working with spreadsheets. We will be using Microsoft Excel and Google Slides. You will be using query language, like structured query language, which is also called SQL. And then we will be working on this data visualization tools in R programming. So yeah, we will not be covering, just to, just to make sure I, I am going to tell you that we're not going to learn Python or work on Python in this curriculum. So this course is designed to be delivered in eight modules. So in the first module, you will be learning the theory and fundamentals about data and learn how data analysts leverage various tools and skills to inform these decisions. We will study the essentials of data lifecycle and data analysis process that are critical to both this course and professional practice. We will be learning foundational concepts through practical examples to enhance your analytical skills using Data Analyst Toolkit, which comprises of spreadsheets, query languages, and data visualization tools, and explore diverse business contexts and the pivotal roles and responsibilities of data analysts within that. Second module will help you understand how to use structured thinking to solve business problems. So this module will focus on developing skills to ask the right questions that drive meaningful analysis. So it will help to ask all those smart questions which are specific, action-oriented, relevant, time-bound. Uh, also in this course, like in this module, we'll discover why spreadsheets are essential tools for data analysts. 
and will cover spreadsheets at length with the help of practical applications of spreadsheets in organizing data. So next module, our third module. In this module, we will be learning a little like this is kind of, this will be a little more lengthy than the first two modules. You will learn crucial skills in data analysis. This includes deciding what data to collect, understanding structured and unstructured data, identifying biases, using spreadsheets and SQL for data management, exploring data ethics, accessing databases effectively, and implementing best practices for organizing and securing data. These skills will help you to handle data confidently and responsibly in a professional setting. Our next module, which is our module four, in this module will be more about processing of data or like preparing and processing of data. So we will be covering data cleaning. You'll be equipped to verify data integrity, apply data cleaning techniques using spreadsheets, writing basic SQL queries, using SQL functions for data transformation, validate cleaned data, and create effective reports. So we have another five, six, and seven modules. In these modules, we will be working on how we will be sharing our insights with the stakeholders and how we will be acting on what results we have obtained through the data analysis. So it's basically uh, all about how we are going to use the tools for data visualization. What is, uh, we'll cover what is our programming language and its programming environment. We'll also understand the concepts associated with programming in R, including functions, variables, data types, pipes, and vectors. And at last, like finally, we will be doing a real world project that you can use during your first interview for data analysis, or you can even use it in your portfolio to see that, to showcase what you have learned through this course. I would also like to tell you that this course, like these modules are kind of lengthy and they will be further divided into sub modules and they would be like four or five sub modules in each module. So the best practice to or the best pace will be yours. But yes, I think this course will take somewhere around two to three months to cover all these modules. We will be using uh, presentations, we'll be using quiz, we will be using some uh, a kind of community to discuss more about um, if you have any, like, discuss more about data analysis and if you have any other questions. In my screen shares, I'll be showing you Microsoft Excel and everything very, so that you can have a practical feel of how and what we're going to learn. So yeah, let's dive into the world of data analytics together. Let's begin. Thank you.